Hi everyone, welcome back to another DVD review where today we are looking at THX number THX, THX 1138, the George Lucas Director's Cut. And by the way, do you like my new neon sign? It's cool. So yeah, this is the first film ever made by George Lucas. The guy that made Star Wars, and only Star Wars and nothing else. But actually, he made this. This is his first film, released in 1971. Like all the other, like all other drugs in the sprawling sub subterranean tech techno technocracy. Te uh, God's sake, he has a designation THX one one three H. He is the product of a number crunching soul numbing society. But there is a flaw: he's human and wants out. George Lucas gave movie lovers notice of the greatness to come with this feature film directorial debut, seen here in the in the in a director's cut. Using astonishing visuals and groundbreaking sound effects, Lucas showed the inventiveness he would later bring to American Graffiti and his Star Wars and Indiana Jones epics. Robert Duvall is the hero behind the number, a man who breaks free of his state-required stupor of drugs, learn, learns the liberating power of love, and seeks out a brave new world. I botched most of those words, but I just got done filming an, an episode of My Thoughts Of, and I'm pretty heated, so I need to watch something before I go to bed. <laughs> So, yeah, it's rated 15 for moderate, no, and violence. I can't say the no-no the word because I'll get copyrighted or I'll get taken down because words. Words are bad. We can't say words. So I'm, I'm saying words, so I'll get copyrighted now. God, I hate the system. Anyways, so look at this DVD. It's very nice. Uh, 2004, or is it? This is a 2015 disc, I think, because the back of the box, I think, says 2000, no, 2016, 2016 disc. Huh. Well, anyways, it's 88, 85 minutes. It's a short film. I haven't seen it yet. I've seen a Star Wars and American Graffiti, and I've also seen the prequels, but I haven't seen this. That means I'll complete his whole filmography, which means that I've completed one director's full filmography, which is just depressing. George Lucas has only made six films. That's pretty sad, but... If you're wondering why I did a shot of a close-up of Robert Duvall's lips, that's because I had to change the position of my hand because it was starting to hurt. Can you blame me? I think I got a, got a, got a good position. So yeah, I got this DVD as one of my Christmas DVDs. So yeah, this is a <laughs> short, short DVD. I haven't seen it yet. I just got done with exams and I have a long line of films planned and this is not one of them. It is short, I will give it that, but I haven't actually watched it yet, because I got busy watching another film with Robert Duvall. It's a... It's an offer you can't refuse, that's all I'm going to say. So, I hope you enjoyed this DVD review, make sure you like, subscribe, and goodbye.